Welcome to my class. This is Jaya Sivastha, class teacher of LKG. How are you all? I hope this video finds you well. You all must be enjoying your holidays. In this lockdown, your mom must be making delicious foods for you. Suppose your mom had baked a cake for you and you find it very tasty. Then you ask her to give you more. Then she asks you how many pieces do you want. You tell her one or two. Here you make use of numbers and let your mother know the number of pieces you want. So today we are going to learn about numbers from 1 to 20 which you have already learned in your previous class. Let's all count from 1 to 20. Count, count, count with me. Count with me from 1 to 20. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 17, 18, 19, 20. Great job. Kids, you have seen the numbers? And now I am going to teach you how to write them. We will start with number 1. You have to join the dots starting from the top to the bottom. And yes, this is number 1. A standing line and done. Let's move on the next number. What comes after number 1? Number 2. Yes, you are absolutely right. A curved line, then a sleeping line. Joining all the dots makes the number 2. Let's do it again. A curved line. Then a sleeping line. Joining all the dots makes a number 2. Moving on the next number, that is number 3. A sleeping line, a slanting line and a curve. Yes! Do it again. A sleeping line, a slanting line and a curve. We got the number 3. So, what's the next number? Very good. It's 4. Let's learn how to write the number 4. One slanting line, one sleeping line and one standing line. One more time. A slanting line, a sleeping line and a standing line makes a number 4. Now, what comes after the number 4? Yes! Number 5. One sleeping line, one slanting line and a curve makes the number 5. One sleeping line, a slanting line and a curve. Yes, we did it. Let's solve some questions. Count and match with correct number. How many pizzas are there? One, two, three. How many french fries are there? One, two, three, four. How many burgers are there? One, two. How many cup soup is there? One. How many ice creams are there? One, two, three, four, five. So, we have completed the exercises. Now, time for your homework. Count the items and write in the box.
kids, you all are having your math workbook. It's your homework to daily practice one page. On first day, practice writing number one. On second day, practice writing number two. On third day, practice writing number three. On fourth and fifth day, practice writing number four and five. And then after one week, I will teach you how to write numbers from 6 to 10. You shall complete your homework in your math book. That's it for today's class, my children. We have been instructed to practice social distancing with the people, but not with the books and our studies. So practice more and keep learning. Thank you.